Hey everybody, my name is Mark Spahowski, Senior VoIP Engineer at VoIP Supply, here to talk a little bit about what is VoIP and different VoIP systems and how they work. VoIP stands for Voice Over Internet Protocol, which basically means we're taking communication which traditionally was made on analog phone lines, and now we're taking that voice and transmitting it over an IP network. So let me be a team player and help with this explanation. Instead of using the telephone lines outside that you see down the street, all we're doing is you're making your phone calls over the internet now. A VoIP telephone system works very similar to a client-server relationship in general IT and IP networking, where there are several endpoints called phones, and these phones will register to the phone system called the registrar. When one phone wants to contact another one, it will contact the registrar, and the registrar will point it to the other phone. I'm sure we've all seen the black and white movies of someone sitting at a switchboard taking one phone line and plugging it into the other. Basically what Mark's trying to explain is that's exactly what the registrar is doing. Once the registrar connects the two phones using a protocol we call SIP or Session Initiation Protocol, the audio is then created between the two phones called RTP, Real-Time Transport Protocol. These two protocols are used to create the communication we know as VoIP. A VoIP phone may look like a phone, but it's actually another computer on your network. It's a computer, basically just a handset attached. It has an operating system, a web server, and an IP address. It's used to translate the analog audio into a digital signal that the SIP server can understand. Don't be scared, you're not getting a second computer on your desk. The phone still calls the same, answers the same, and dials the same. You just get some added features now with it. Some phones, you can even integrate your apps on your phone with it, which is pretty cool. Voice over IP systems aren't always limited to IP phones. We can also use analog devices like plain old analog phones and fax machines using devices we call gateways. A gateway will SIP register to the phone system and allow that communication to be translated from analog to VoIP. Some of you may be wondering, do I have to change my entire phone system over to VoIP? The answer is, not necessarily. You can slowly transition your existing analog or digital system into VoIP by installing two systems simultaneously and using the gateways I mentioned before to make that transition, while connecting analog telephones and fax machines, or using what we call an FXO gateway to plug into your existing analog lines from the telco. You can also use gateways such as a T1 PRI gateway to so connect directly to an existing legacy stop, system. Stop, 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 cut it out, cut it out. Long story short, this is where our solutions experts come in. They will either teach you and help you to learn these technical aspects, or we can just fully take it off your plate and we'll handle all that type of stuff for you. When considering switching to a VoIP system, there are two main types of systems to consider. There is the on-premise system, which means there is a server or appliance in your building organization. And there is the cloud-based or hosted phone system, which means the server lives in a data center in the cloud. This is just a brief explanation of VoIP, and it's not something that's understood immediately. Please let us know if you have any questions. VoIP Supply is a leading internet retailer of voice over IP hardware with over 125,000 customers worldwide. Click subscribe to stay up to date on the latest from VoIP Supply in VoIP technology. Thanks for watching.